हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज तेजस एंड वेलकम टू माई चैनल सेल्फ स्टडी विथ तेजस टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न एन एस ओ क्लास सिक्स चैप्टर सिक्स लाइट शेडोज एंड रिफ्लेक्शंस सो लेट स्टार्ट सो चैप्टर सिक्स लाइट शेडोज एंड रिफ्लेक्शंस फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन एन इमेज दैट इज नॉट प्रोड्यूस बाय लाइट रेज कमिंग फ्रॉम द इमेज बट इज द रिजल्ट ऑफ यूर ब्रेन इंटरप्शन ऑफ दिस लाइट रेज इज कॉल्ड अ स्लैश एंड डैश so an image that is not produced by light rays is called as virtual image and an an image that is produced by light rays is called a real image so here uh, they have asked for that is not produced which means our correct answer will be option number b virtual image now second question which of the following are the properties of image formed by a plane mirror first the image is at the same distance as the object so yes this is a property of a plane mirror second the image is upright yes this is also a property now third the image is laterally inverted yes means uh, all three are the properties of a plane mirror which means option number d 1 2 and 3 so third question the diagram shows two divergent rays of light from an object o ref being reflected from a plane mirror at which position will the image be formed so object is at the same distance as its image which means if object is here then its image will form here which means at q place so correct answer will be option number b now fourth question a girl is 4 meter away from the plane mirror if she moves few steps closer to the mirror what will happen to the size of the image in the mirror consider that she can see her complete image in the both the cases so if the girl moves closer to the mirror then also the size of the uh, image will be the same only so correct answer here will be option number c now first question a plane mirror reflects a pencil of light to form a real image then the pencil of light incident on the mirror is convergent so correct answer here will be option number b Now sixth question. Study the setup shown here. So first here is a book, then ring, and then screen. So the ring is much smaller than the book. So the book will cover up the ring. So uh, in the shadow, ring will not appear. So uh, it will look like this. So correct answer will be option number C. Now seventh question. There is no dark shadow formed by the glass tumbler. when a uh, light falls on it this is because so we know that the glass shown there was transparent and no shadow uh, shadow appears for uh, anything that is transparent so our correct answer will be option number c now eighth question which of the following statement is true a the image formed by a pinhole camera is inverted because light travels in a straight line so yes this is a correct statement which means our correct answer here will be option number a so ninth question filling the blanks with the most appropriate option although a number of obje objects such as kites birds aeroplanes move in space but their shadow is not seen on earth this is due to reason that the dash so this is uh, due to a uh, reason that is called umbra so considering that this is the sun and this uh, this is our earth and the light goes like this and uh, this uh, uh, in this area there is no light because of earth which is full of darkness which we call as umbra and this side there is a partially uh, brightness partial brightness is there so we call it as uh, brightness which we call penumbra so if we see it so our uh, answer here will be umbra and now the region of complete so i told here that this is due to there is very darkness here so uh, our correct answer is here option number c but still we will solve all the banks is not able to reach the earth the region of partial dash that is the dash so uh, in partial light it is called penumbra and it has partially brightness which means brightness and yet that is the penumbra so here it will come penumbra 
So our correct answer here will be option number C. Now tenth question. In case of three plane mirrors meeting at the point to form a corner of a cube, if incident light suffers one reflection on each other. So, in case of three plane mirrors meeting at a point to form a corner of a cube, if incident light suffers one reflection on each other, as it is anti-parallel to incident one, which means our correct answer here will be option number. A. So, eleventh question: A student views an object O after reflection through a plane mirror. Which is the correct ray diagram? A. So here, this incident ray is going correctly, and this second incident ray is going incorrectly because when it is going here, it should go this side, not directly in the eye. So now B. So yes, this incident ray is again going correctly, and this is also going. Correctly, which means our uh, correct answer will be option number B. Twelfth question: A girl stands at the point P as shown in the given figure. Four of her friends are standing at the points W, X, Y, and Z. The girl is unable to see her uh, other uh, other friends directly due to a wall separating her and the girls. By means of a mirror placed as shown. How many of the four can she see? So here it is a wall, and here is a mirror. So she can see W, and she can also see X. And by this, uh, and by this, and doing like this, she can see all her four friends. Which means her correct answer here will be option number D. So thirteenth question: A bird flying high up in air does not cast shadow on the ground because the size of the bird is much smaller than the sun. So the correct answer here will be option number A. So fourteenth question: Three sticks are placed in an open field as shown in the given figure. Which of the following sticks will Form the shadow of equal lengths. So our answer will be here one and three because in uh, figure two the uh, the sun is uh, both the stick and in figure one and three the sun is behind the stick. Which means our correct answer will be option number C. Now fifteenth question. Nisha plays the stick vertically in the playground at eight fifteen a.m. in morning. How will the shadow of the stick at twelve noon be in comparison to one at eight fifteen a.m.? So, a it will be shorter than one at eight fifteen. B it will be same as one at the eight fifteen. C it will be greater than one at eight fifteen. Or D shadow will not. Form at twelve noon. So the correct answer here will be option number A because uh, during morning the sun is slant in slanting position, but during uh, twelve noon it is uh, exactly above our head, which means it will be a very short shadow. Which means our correct answer here will be option number A. Now achieve a section sixteen question. Look at the Venn diagram. Which of the following ob objects described here are most likely to be one, two, and three? Choose the correct option. So first is transparent, second is translucent, and third is opaque. So in first, for uh, A option is oil paper, which is incorrect for trans uh, transparent. Now B glass. So yes, glass is transparent. C wax paper. Wax paper is not transparent. And now D mirror, which is again transparent. So correct option could be from B or D. So now in B, in translucent, uh, they have uh, it is frosted glass, which is translucent. And in D option, it is diamond, which is not translucent. Which means our correct uh, option will be option number B. But still, we will read the third one. So. In that uh, opaque, they have written wood, which is correct. Which means our correct answer will be option number B. Now, seventeen question: A card with uh, with the word bulb written on it is placed in front of a plane mirror, as shown in the figure. The image of the word bulb seen in the mirror is so. Our correct answer here uh, here is option number B. Uh, option number A. Now 18th question Geeta placed three objects 1 2 
वन टू एंड थ्री एज शोन इन दी फिगर शी ऑब्जर्व अ ब्राइट स्पॉट ऑफ लाइट एट टू बट थ्री वुड नॉट गेट एनी स्पॉट देन सो द लाइट इज गोइंग टिल टू बट ऑन थ्री इट इज नॉट विजिबल विच मीन्स वी नो दैट वन इज ट्रांसपेरेंट बट टू इज ओपेक एंड वी कैन नॉट डिफाइन वॉट इज थर्ड मटेरियल विच मीन्स अवर करेक्ट आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर सी वन इज मेड ऑफ ट्रांसपेरेंट मटेरियल टू इज मेड ऑफ मेड अप ऑफ ओपैक मटेरियल एंड थर्ड कैन बी मेड ऑफ इधर ट्रांसपेरेंट और ओपैक और ट्रांसलूसेंट मटेरियल सो नाइनटीन क्वेश्चन फोर लाइट बल्ब P, Q, R एंड S आर कॉन्सील्ड फ्रॉम एन ऑब्जर्वर बाय एन ओपैक वॉल एज शोन इन दी फिगर विदाउट शिफ्टिंग दी पोजिशन ऑफ दी ऑब्जर्वर एंड दी बल्ब हाउ मेनी बल्ब कैन दी ऑब्जर्वर सी इन दी मिरर सो बिकॉज आर इज ओपर ओवरलैपिंग पी ही कैन नॉट सी आर बट ही कैन सी पी क्यू एंड एस विच मीन्स आवर करेक्ट आंसर हियर वुड बी ऑप्शन नंबर सी नाउ ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन रीड द गिवन स्टेटमेंट्स एंड सिलेक्ट द करेक्ट ऑप्शन सो स्टेटमेंट वन राहुल प्लेस अ कलर्ड प्लास्टिक बॉटल इन फ्रंट ऑफ द बीम ऑफ अ टॉर्च लाइट देन ही प्लेस अ ट्रांसपेरेंट शीट ऑफ सेम साइज ऑन द अदर साइड ऑफ द बॉटल नो शेडो विल फॉर्म ऑन अ स्क्रीन प्लेस बिहाइंड द शीट सो दिस अ इन करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट एंड ऑफ स्टेटमेंट टू ट्रांसलूसन ऑब्जेक्ट्स अलाउ लाइट टू पास थ्रू दैम पार्शली सो दिस इज करेक्ट विच मीन्स ऑप्शन नंबर डी स्टेटमेंट वन इज फॉल्स बट स्टेटमेंट टू इज True. If you liked our video, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.